Right, Spirit Week is in full swing at St. Francis High School and a familiar face is back in the old stomping grounds this morning for the grand finale. We got a lot of good day ladies going back to their alma yeah. maters. Now we got Molly Real who's ready to join in on the fun with the Trubies. Hi Molly. I know. <laughs> Yeah, welcome to my alma mater, <laughs> proud class of 2007. And let me tell you this about St. Francis. It is not difficult to get these young ladies excited. Hey, hey! This is Truby Territory. That's right. Okay, so it's Spirit Week at St. Francis, and that is not just one day. That is an entire week, and no one does it quite like a troubadour. So we kick off Monday. This is uh, the student body officers right here. Give them a big hand, everybody. Talk about Monday. It's all about kind of giving back, uh, building a community through that too, right? Yes, exactly. So Monday we have a canned food drive, and all of the cans go back to the SAC Food Bank, and then after we have a prayer service praying over all the cans. Okay, beautiful. Then Tuesday. Tuesday's class meeting day and we also had anything but a backpack day so I brought a bike and put all my books in the basket but people brought sleds, uh, any <laughs> other basket, wagons, things like yeah. that. Being a Truby means a uh, commitment to creativity for sure. What about Wednesday? Yes, Wednesday we have our infamous sports day where all the classes kind of compete against each other in games like musical chairs, dodgeball, yeah. It's all about friendly competition. Everyone dressed up in their class jerseys and it was just a lot of fun to bring the hype and cheer in the gym. <laughs> and you know how to cheer. Okay, tell us about spirit spit sticks. This is not something we did when I was here. So basically we like to do anything to get spirit points. So spirit sticks are really easy. It's like a game of hide and seek for all the classes. Each class has a stick, they decorate it, they hide it, they add clues and they get points for fighting, uh, finding other classes sticks. And their spirit, of course, uh, the sisterhood, though. It's what it's all about. And at the end of the week, the classes are competing against each other. But boy, you feel that bond, don't you? Definitely 100%. I mean, on Thursday, it's the last day of deck, which means that's the culmination of three weeks of hard work. You're from one to seven. You're, it's insane. The energy is crazy. You do a cheer at the end, and that's the way to kick off Hoko Week. Right. During homecoming week, everybody's included. There's something for everyone. You see all these girls here. A lot of them don't know each other at all, but they're all here at <laughs> 8 in the morning to cheer, and they don't know why. That's And they don't know why. Now, we know why. It's because it's great to be an SF Troubadour, isn't it? So today is the culmination of Spirit Week. Yeah. They go big today. It is theme day. This year, the theme is cities. Woo. Isn't that right? Okay, yeah. so uh, we're going to take you into the gym in the 9 o'clock hour to show you the decorations. They have skits planned. Adam Sandler, come out. <laughs> Adam Sandler is here to start one of the skits incredible I love that about you uh, but uh, overall I just I can't tell you enough what this week meant to me as a troubadour where's Sarah Z Sarah uh, and I just want to introduce you Sarah here now works at St. Francis we went to school together from kindergarten to senior year in high school so we're troopies together oh, yeah. oh, yes. it's so good to see you all right should we should we start the chant with them Let's do it. it is great, great. To be an SF Troubadour, it's great to be an SF Troubadour, it's great to be an SF Troubadour, it's great to be an SF Troubadour, it's great. <laughs> I can feel the spirit from here, Malls. 